happening right now. People are running in remembrance. It has been exactly a week since police say Cleotha Henderson abducted Eliza Fletcher while on her morning run. Our Lakita Johnson is live along the route this morning with more on why these runners are finishing Liza's run. Good morning, Lakita. Good morning, Aaron. Look, it's been a very long week, a very tiring week for Memphis. And after all of this doom and gloom, people have gathered and they still are running. You can see behind me, we've got somebody running this uh, this road uh, on Central uh, Avenue and South Goodlett. Uh, but people are just really coming together and you can see the community is really tightening up and showing their support and celebrating the life of Eliza Fletcher. And many people met here at four this morning and started this 8.2 mile run at 420 around the time that Eliza would have started running this morning, uh, leaving from Central Avenue and Belvedere Boulevard and circling the U of M area at Zach Curlin. Now, organizers say about 3000 people locally and in other states signed up to participate. So this run isn't just happening here. It's happening this morning at the same time in other places again to celebrate the life of Miss Fletcher. Now, this run is about women not being shamed for running at 4 a.m. Him. Also, people are finishing up this race. Uh, they have to be in their cars by 7 because the bus routes, of course. Uh, but we'll keep you guys updated with uh, as, the, as the morning goes on because it has picked up. So, again, in Memphis, I'm Lakita Johnson. Back to you guys. Thank you, Lakita. Really good to see all the police presence there as well. But it is something. Women shouldn't be afraid to run no matter what time it is. But they aren't the only people remembering Eliza Fletcher this morning. We're actually taking a live look at Grace St. Luke's Church in Midtown, where people are gathering there to honor Fletcher. You can see a few on the steps, and we've even seen some people from the run running by those steps. A prayer vigil is going on right now, and it will continue throughout the morning.